So I've been getting a lot of requests lately about how to change your app icons on Windows 10. So today I'm going to be showing you how to do that and make sure you watch the whole entire video and don't skip any parts because you might miss a very important step and let's get right into the video. So the first step is you actually want to find an icon you want to replace. So I'm just going to replace the Chrome icon here. So I'm just going to search up cool Chrome icons PNG. So here we got tons of really cool Chrome icons. Here, I think I'm just going to pick this one. This one looks pretty cool. I'm just going to save it as. I'm just going to press save. There we go. As you can see, I saved it. And the next step is you want to go to icoconvert.com. So icoconvert.com. And all links will be down in the description down below. Then I'm going to choose my file. I'm going to choose my PNG icon. Then I'm going to press upload. There we go. And you can crop your image if you want, but I'm just going to keep it like this. Then I'm just going to keep the original one. You can crop in all these special shapes if you want, apply different styles. And then you want to go and you want to make sure you click on 256 by 256 there. And then you want to click on convert to ICO. And you can press download your icons. And there you go. That's our icon file. Now that I got my icon file here, we actually want to create a shortcut. Since I don't actually, I deleted all my shortcuts. I'm just going to create a brand new shortcut. So the way you want to do that is you want to press new shortcut. And then I'm just going to find the Chrome. So basically to find Chrome, you want to go to Browse. I'm going to go to this PC. I'm going to go to my main drive, Program Files, Google, and that's Chrome.exe. I'm going to press OK. Next, I'm going to rename it Chrome. Finish. And there we go. We got a new one. See a new shortcut called Chrome. And then this is the big part. You want to right click on it. You want to click on Properties. And you want to press Change Icon. Then I'm going to press Browse. Then I'm going to go to my desktop and I'm going to click on my icon file and press open. Press apply. Okay, and there we go. As you can see, my Chrome icon changed to this special icon I picked here and you can open it, open it up and it opens up Chrome. Usually you won't have to create all your shortcuts again because usually when you install a program, it already puts a shortcut on your desktop for you. But since I deleted all my shortcuts, every time I do, I'm going to have to create a new shortcut. So now you're probably wondering, how do I put this on my taskbar? Because as you can see, the Chrome icon there is still the original Chrome icon. So what you're going to do is you're going to click on here and you're going to put unpin from taskbar. Then I'm click on here, the shortcut I made, and I'm going to press right here, pin to taskbar. And there we go, as you can see, Chrome is on the taskbar with a custom icon. When I click on it, it opens up Chrome. If you didn't know yet, Windows actually comes with some pre-installed shortcuts. This includes the, the recycling bin shortcut, the this PC shortcut, and the user account shortcut. So I'm gonna be showing you how to change those icons because they're quite different than changing a shortcut icon. So I'm gonna be demonstrating here with the recycling bin icon here. So as you guys can see, I downloaded a special custom recycling bin icon here. As you can see, it's a dot icon file. And then to do this, you want to right click on your desktop, you want to go to personalize, then you want to go to themes. Once you're in a the theme section, you want to click on desktop icon settings. And then as you guys can see, here it is, this PC, my user account, network, recycling bin full, and recycling bin empty. So I'm just going to click on recycling bin full here, and I'm going to press change icon, browse, and here I'm going to go to my desktop, and here's my custom icon, I'm going to press open, OK, I'm going to press apply. And there we go. As you guys can see, my recycling bin icon has changed to this icon. It opens up my recycling bin here. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. And if you guys need any help at all, you don't understand something, make sure you join my Discord server. I'm very happy to help you. And we are getting so close to 1,000 subscribers. Make sure you guys subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.